What's up, everybody? I'm Dr. Mark Whitfield, Assistant Director of Athletic Bands and Instructor of Low Brass here at North Carolina State University. And today I'm going to be going over the 2023 North Carolina Bandmasters Association All-State Honor Band Audition Repertoire for 7th and 8th grade. Let's jump right into the solo. <laughs> As you prepare for your audition, it's important to keep a few things in mind. This solo is essentially divided into two contrasting sections. It starts soft, smooth, and melodic, and then gets louder and more articulated before the melodic stuff from the beginning comes back at the end. You really want to exaggerate all of those differences. So the smoother and softer you play at the beginning, the more the louder articulated stuff in the middle is going to grab your listener's attention. The more you exaggerate that, the better off you'll be. Second, this piece is in E flat major. So you want to make sure you know your E flat major scale up and down, backwards and forwards. You always want to be confidently playing in the key that it's written. That being the case, there are several accidentals to be aware of too. Accidentals are notes that fall outside the key and they color the harmony a different way. So you really want to lean into those. Again, exaggerate those, lean into them and it's going to grab your listener's attention even more. Third, exaggerate everything else about the piece. If there's a theme to this video today, it's do more than you think you need to so that your musical intent is extremely clear to the judges and you grab and hold their attention for the entire audition. Exaggerate your dynamics, your articulations, your stylistic differences section to section, even those little Italian terms, dolce, martial, look up what those mean and do that times 10 when you're playing. At that point, not only are you playing with a high level of technical proficiency, it also makes your musical intent very clear to the judges. Last but not least, make sure you're practicing both endings. If you're fortunate enough to get a call back and wind up auditioning for Allstate in March, you want to make sure you're familiar with that second ending. It's a little bit more challenging, but everything I've said so far in this video holds true. Make sure you apply all of it to that ending. <laughs> Once again, everybody, I'm Dr. Mark Whitfield. I hope this video has been helpful. If you have any questions, feel free to reach out to me on Instagram at jmarkwhitfield. I'm also going to leave my email address at the bottom of the screen and in the description below. Good luck on your auditions, and happy practicing.